Uh, good afternoon, everybody. So, uh, uh, Dhruva Space is an aerospace space startup based out of Bangalore for the last three years. Um, we uh, have, uh, the founding team uh, has mixed experiences in education and uh, work in uh, three different continents uh, before we started up this company here in, uh, in Bangalore. What we want to do is, uh, um, you know, the space industry is uh, $200 billion in global market levels, and uh, India uh, does at best, uh, by Antrix, about $200 million of business, and uh, in all other SMEs put together, about $50 million. So India potentially does uh, less than 0.5% of the entire world's <laughs> business in space. Uh, so what we are trying to do is, uh, you know, uh, capitalize on what we have in uh, multicultural and multidisciplinary uh, experiences and using India's technology base and uh, inherent advantages of manpower and so on to leverage that to our advantages to cater to the local market as well as the global one. So, uh, so we're looking at uh, 5,000 satellites being built in the next 10 years uh, over, the, over the world and if some of these can be actually done in India as well as the defense market in India opening up it will be a big uh, uh, opener. So. One of the other key things is, uh, you know, uh, we are the only, one of the only developing countries in the world that can do end-to-end -end turnkey solution in space. So there's not many countries in the world which can launch a satellite, do ground operations, build satellites. So no company in this country is able to utilize that opportunity uh, to say we are going to package everything here in, in India and offer it to the world commercially. So uh, the, the other thing is, of course, is uh, there's not much of space being used uh, in tactical warfare and in Elint and so on, it's only related uh, mostly to, I mean, limited to some imaging and some communication and so on. But there's a lot of scope here. So uh, what we envision to do is, uh, I, I don't know if you guys know the company like SSTL, which is based out of uh, UK. So which basically started building smaller satellites and then became really big. Uh, so there are many models like this. So we especially are focused on small satellites right now, which are less than 100 kilograms. So these satellites uh, can provide specific capabilities in, in C4 ISR and commercial uh, so on. So for example, uh, in, from, a make in, from a Deftronics perspective, uh, it could help in rapid imaging for the Army, uh, automatic identification of ships for the Navy, and uh, radar mapping and electromagnetic wave mapping for the Air Force. I mean, these are come up completely C4 ISR standpoint. From uh, a Make in India perspective, uh, we recently signed a an MOU with a, a German company called Berlin Space Technologies uh, to potentially outsource uh, some of the uh, components and the satellite development to us here in India. So there are two different angles uh, that, that come into uh, to our business right now. Um, so as I just said, um, yeah, I don't know if I have time to talk about a couple of pain points. Yeah. Yeah. All right, yeah. So we, I'll probably brief about all our pain points in the later stage.